Big hopes for a little bird. Currently we're sitting at somewhere between 65 and 70 individuals remaining in the wild. Um, that's a recovery in the last five years from a low of 17 birds. The birds spend winter in southern mainland states before returning to southwest Tasmania to breed. The first eggs of the season have been confirmed at Melaleuca and volunteers are busy making observations. It's important that we understand what it eats here, what it eats on the mainland, what its patterns of behaviour are and what we can do to help produce the food that it needs to survive. Chicks are also hatching at a captive breeding centre outside Hobart. The conservation program expects about 50 fledglings this summer. Captive bred birds play an important role in the wild population's recovery. The captive bred adults that we release breed really well, but they don't migrate as well as wild birds. However, when we release captive bred birds as juveniles, they migrate just as successfully as wild birds do. The captive parrots are fed a mixture of seeds, grains, fruits and vegetables. For enrichment, native grasses and some common weeds like these are grown to add to their diet. They really love weeds like the dock that you can see growing here and anything that's, that's pretty much giving them something novel to explore is what we try to achieve. A recipe for the species survival. Loretta Loberger, ABC News.